Hello guys and welcome to the Beyond Sana's channel, my name is Shanks and today we're gonna finish off the evil campaign in the Shadow and Flame mod for Battle for Middle Earth 1. I couldn't stop, I just wanted to play the Minas Tirith today. I was just recently doing the Shelob mission and afterwards I was doing the Care Andros, which was taking me legit 3 minutes with my troll army, I was running them down. So I didn't even record this one because I feel like it's time for the ultimate mission which is gonna be winning the campaign. And we're gonna be using the Mordor army with the Witch King, one Muma kill, 45 trolls and Gothmog. And watch this ladies and gentlemen, today we're gonna attack Minas Tirith. I mean we have a couple of options, we could be, of, of course if we want to, uh, go all the other missions to get all the power points we need, level up our heroes. But that's gonna take a lot of time, remember after the evil campaign I wanna also do the uh, good campaign in the Shadow and Flame mod. And for that reason, today is gonna be the day, Minas Tirith, ladies and gentlemen. You will see this video one day after uh, the Shelob campaign, but it's fine. It's fine, because Minas Tirith normally takes a little bit longer time. Let's do this. That's gonna be Fiesta. Minas Tirith is the city upon which all the hopes yes. of men rest. It is a dream that will end in devastation. Alright, let's see if Minas Tirith gets what it needs. Ooh, look at this army, boys! Let's go! The Witch King, I mean, that's fake, by the way. Our Witch King isn't able to fly like that. We have also no orcs. And no gay. this things, you know, say it. The siege uh, things. Gets food from these villages. The world of men is coming to an end. What is this? I actually don't have... What? Oh, these orcs are already there from the beginning. I see you. Look how they are glowing, guys. The Nazgul, the Witch King. <laughs> no way! I mean, I love this dude. He's level 10 too. Oh, that's gonna be epic, man. Come on now. Come on now. Can we get dismounted with them? No, that's not possible. Our trolls, let's press E, select them all, number one, and the drama trolls, where are they? Here they are, E, and give them number one, and number two, I mean. Okay, so let's get this camp. We have Sauron, of course, we have Sauron and two Nazgûls, and the Witch King, of course, but once again, he's uh, mounted, on, you know, a hero on foot, or he can be mounted on the horse, but not on the Felvis anymore. Okay. I think that's we can actually run them down. We have 14 power points in total. We can, you know, just pick up this one, I guess. The rain to nullify their leadership bonuses. You could also be using Isengard army, but I want to just, you know, make it like in the films. Because it was Mordor, which was attacking Gondor, and it's not Isengard. Alright, so... Slaughterhouse, 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 Slaughterhouse. Wait a second, this spot can be saved for the Mumma Kill Pen. Because I am actually kind of sad if we don't have enough Mumma Kills. We need to make sure that we have at least six slaughterhouses. This way we can get the maximum value um, from the foot bonus, which is gonna make our uh, trolls and Muma kills cheap, cheaper, you know? Now we have here five and seven just to be safe. And furnaces otherwise, because furnaces once again are tankier buildings, okay? That's the goal. Now we can just send those orcs you now forward. We don't need them. They are just taking away our command points for no reason. This, ladies and gentlemen, is Minas Tirith. And uh, trust me, in a couple of minutes, this is not gonna look like that anymore. It's not gonna shine bright like a diamond anymore. Gandalf level 10, you know what's up. Okay? I have Sauron is available. We're gonna wait for the Muma Kill Pan to come up. I'm actually... Wait a second. I was forgetting about one thing. Are we able to recruit Grunt in this one? Maybe later on, right? Because Grunt is a, is a, you know, by the way, Grunt exists, if you don't know, in Battle for Middle Earth 2. It costs like 10,000, but it's gonna one-shot everything. And normally Grunt, uh, you know, obviously we all we all know the Lord of the Ring films, uh, was existing only in the in the Return of the King films uh, during the Siege of Minas Tirith. Okay, so we lost a lot of orcs, but it's fine. Grunt. Okay, let's go for the Grunt. I take it. Does he... 10 command points only, you know what? I take it. What is, what is that? You wanna fight Sauron? Are you out of your... Are you out of your mind? 
No way you try to kill the Dark Lord. Gondonite, you are brave. Or stupid, one of the two things. Or both at the same time, can also be the keys. Okay, we have uh, Gandalf opening. Where are the other heroes? I'm missing out Faramir here. I'm missing out, um, of course, Aragorn and stuff like this. Spoiler alert, they're gonna come later on. I mean, if you haven't watched the films yet, what are you doing here, bro? You know, you obviously have to be a Lord of the Ring fan to be here. Are we limited to five? Yes, we are limited to five. So we can get five of them on the field, just why not? Grant is coming quite fast. Let's make some more Mooma kills. And also you are limited with them, right? Four, four only. So you can have only four of them at the same time. Anyways, Darkness is available. And uh, does he give leadership? Sauron inspires fear into all nearby units. Be, be they friend or foe, okay. Telekinesis. Sauron can manipulate objects with his mind. Knockbacks battalion or hero from a range. Anatar, Lord of Gifts, uh, converts enemy units in large radius. Large radius and configuration. Uh, destroy enemy hero. Deals only 25% damage to Durin, Spain, Gandalf, the White, Saur Saruman, Elisar, and Radagask. You can't keep us out forever. Send in Grand. Send in Grand. Let's go. That's gonna be. I'm sending it immediately, guys. Rohan army arrives in already. Okay. You know what? I'm ready for the first round. I'm ready for the first round. And uh, in order to be prepared for the worst case scenario, let's build also some troll cages. Just in case something goes super wrong, troll cage, troll cage. Because the, with, the thing with the Muma kills is we, we are only have we are only allowed to have four of them. Let's use darkness. It's gonna make them even tankier and deal more damage. Do we even need Grunt, guys? Do we even need Grunt? I think we're gonna break the gates. Look, this is a very tanky wall, but we are able to break it like it's nothing, like it's nothing. And Grunt is coming too for the gate. And, and, you know, imagine if I would get the chance to lead the armies of Mordor in the films or in the books. It would be a different story. Who needs weak orcs when you can have an army like that with full of trolls? That's what I'm talking about. Slowly but surely taking down the gate. Once again, this is a hard, uh, this is hard um, campaign, so it's not going to be one-shotted. Troll, 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 troll for days. We need more, 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 more. Oh, we have no much, not much money left. Let's use Devastation to change the fact. And also remember, we need to kill this uh, trebuchets first. You know what? We're gonna send in the Nazgûls. We don't need them anyway. He has too many trebuchets with Firestone upgrades on top of the wall. We are so strong right now. We are so strong right now. Holy moly. I mean, Grunt was able to break the gate. Rohan army arrives. Oh, eagles are coming. Really? These guys are cheating. When I play good campaign, I don't get eagles in the Minas City fight. I only get them in the black uh, gate fight. We release the mountain trolls, if this is already not enough. Let's break it. Come down there, my friends. Let's break. I mean, I like I liked the fact that they're able to throw rocks like that. You have no, you have never seen Minas City like that, did you? How easy it is actually to break the walls with the trolls, it's unbelievable. They have darkness, 33% damage, boys. A 50% from the drama troll. We lost the Nazguts, but it's fine. Eagles are coming now. Oh, that's gonna be bad, but it's okay. I don't know what eagles are doing, really. They should be just... Let's kill this too. I mean, Rohan thinks he can change something. He's... Arise, arise, like of the the what is that? Shall be huh? the enemy is on us. That's confusing, man. That's really confusing. What? That is not how it's supposed to be. Where is Theodin? I want to I 1v9 one me, one me them. This is so funny, I've not... I mean, it's been a long time that I played the campaign, but I'm pretty certain that it was Theodin who was speaking and not Eowyn. He was even rebuying, rebuying the <coughs> trebuchets. We are able to rebuy the grunt. Okay. Can we break? No, we can't break anymore. Okay, guys. What is... What are you doing here? 
You wanna fight? You wanna play rough? Pew! Sauron is a boss. I mean, Sauron, let's be honest, it's not even needed. Uh, if you played a bit more smart, the trolls would be more than enough to handle the situation. Trust me on that one. Oh, what is happening? The skies are... Reckless. Let's, let's call it reckless, because how can you try to fight with horses against Muma kills? Don't try to do that. Look at this. <laughs> okay, okay. Break, break the... The trolls, they refuse to die. We have so many of them. Darkness once again. Now we gotta send out the Muma kills, ladies and gentlemen. Break the gates. Break the wall, I mean. The, the Katas are hurting, actually. Did we revive our Nazgûls yet? No, we can't revive them. Okay. We killed the entire army, by the way. Where is Gunzelf? Did we already kill him? Now is the time to show our quality. <laughs> Faramir wants to show his quality again. I don't know about that, Faramir. The captain of Gunzelf. I mean, we are just ignoring everything. Normally, we are not supposed to play like that, but it's fine. We, have, we are getting more and more trolls anyway. Okay, we are running out of money though. That's the problem what we got. But it's gonna be changed very soon. Let's use devastation and industry. And Umba reinforcements. We already know what that means, right? Spoiler alert, it's not our Umba reinforcements, trust me. Hey, hey, Sauron. Oof, this guy. Do it. Do it, Sauron. If you're gonna lose him, are we gonna lose the campaign? Because he's extremely fa- uh, I mean, not fast. He's very strong, but he's also extremely slow. There is an army watching Minas Tirith fall. What kind of memers are you? And you know what? I don't like the fact that they are switching to the uh, battle troll thing once they reach level 2. It's not optional. It's a force thing. Once once they reach level two, you need to fight. With you, you, you see, you have no other choices. Okay, let's kill all these. Uh, kill this, please. Come on. Did we kill it? Yes, we killed it. Nice. Okay, we killed almost every single. And, and Sauron was able to survive too. That's nice. I want to see Sauron versus Aragorn, guys. Am I too greedy? Am I, too greedy for, am I too greedy for this one? And it's unfair, I can't attack this units. I can't attack this units. Because Mumma kill are too thick to actually enter the second piece. Just attack, do something. Did we lose? Ah, we lost all the drama trolls, boys. It means we have no more leadership. Let's use Freezing Rain in this case to cancel their leadership bonuses. Let's kill all in the first area at least. That's what we can do. Okay. Are they permanent? No, no. Run, Sauron. You, you might be strong, but you are not as strong as you think. Okay. Just fight your way up. We, I mean, unfortunately, we lost the drama trolls. I, I want to see this. Where is Legolas? Legolas. Let's see. He's level 7. The army of the dead is going to be gone now. He's basically full health, right? He's full health. Aha! I want to trample you, Gimli's. I want to I see this. Can I trample them? Sit down. Aragorn, the king of Gondor. The last hope of men versus the Dark Lord Sauron himself. He actually hurts. Holy moly. You win, bro. Run. Can we revive him? No, we can't. Ooh. I like the animation. Darkness. Handle the situation. Gimli is dead. And Aragorn is dead. But we need to keep going on. 
I think what, what we need to do, let me check. Uh, destroy Minas Tirith, yeah, I mean, <laughs> pretty self-explaining, am I right? We need to destroy every single building. I and mean, the trolls are not doing anything by themselves, so you need to... There is one just watching and doing absolutely nothing. We killed all the catapults, though. That's great. No, he was rebuying them once again. You fool. No man can kill you. I know. We know. We, we already know. Okay, Muma kill. You just kill the farm here slowly but surely. The troll is dead, but it's okay. We, have, we are getting more units on the fields now. I'm actually curious if this Grunt is also able to attack, for example... Yeah, you are able to attack buildings too. That's nice then. Let's destroy this uh, trebuchet. Okay, yeah, you guys also go. We need to get trolls on the field. That's what we need to do. It was pretty easy, not gonna lie, guys. I think our army, the forest of Mordor, with this many trolls was just kind of too strong. Especially the fact that they are able to throw rocks infinitely. Makes them... Like, how can you deal with that, you know? With, against this many trolls, explain me that. Look, they can even shoot, I believe, from the from downtown, right? No, no, they can't, okay. We're under attack. Just throw rocks, then. Yeah, you can, you can. Look this. Yeah, it, have fun dealing with that, you know? We are even getting more trolls on the field. Let's get more trolls. Uh, money is a little bit problem, but it's okay. We can use scavenger again. Uh, I mean, not scavenger. The vestition once again. The second it's available, just use it. Okay. Witch king. You fool. Go witch king. Carry the armies of Mordor. I can't attack this. Okay. I want, I want to go up. Can this thing go up? No, right? No, you can't go up. Uh, it's not possible. It's too, it's too thick, you know? And it's also very slow, but it's very tanky. 8,000 HP. Pretty good. This Muma kill was able to destroy this farm. Oh, you know what? Where is the, where is the villager? I'm coming, my friend. Wait, hold on a second. <laughs> I'm an evil person sometimes. <laughs> okay. Can we attack this? Yeah, we can attack this too. But you are not able to deal damage to the outer wall, you see that? Okay, go up. Alright. More trolls are needed. More trolls are required. We need to use industry. Even though we have like... You know what? We can demolish these buildings because literally we have only two slaughterhouses. That's why we have no money. And also quick... Um, Tip from my side, you can also use industry when the buildings are in the building stage. So it's not finished yet, but watch what's gonna happen the second it's finished. So we have used industry after building that, but we have not... We are not waiting until the building is finished. They still got the, in the industry buff, you know? Keep that please in mind. Okay? Just kill everything on your way. Drama troll, you can peel up back a little bit. Just, just kill everything on your way. Every single building can be finished. This building is not taking damage. So we need to be careful. There are still two farms from him. So we can try to destroy them. Like that. So the Mumma kid is gonna finally do something automatically. And you, one catapult, can also destroy the last farm outside. And in the meantime, we can just get more and more trolls on the field. Our trolls are still remaining on the field. Uh, Witch King can also join the party. To feel a bit more useful than he already is, Kappa. Just use darkness, shall we? Alright, so you guys you guys go here. And I believe that's the last building, am I right? No, no. There are still a couple of more buildings. And he was even rebuying this stuff on the bottom side. What is this troll doing there? Oof, one-shotting. So strong, so strong. And Mumma kills are desperately trying to hurt a building which is... You know... Immune to damage, pretty much. Okay, the trolls are coming. The Mumma kill here can also do something, maybe? Did we finish off these farms? Yes, we did. And also this farm has been taken down. Let's use this shot. Drama troll is here. And we also forgot about Gothmog. And once again, normally, if you keep playing the missions, you will get the power points you need to unlock everything from the spellbook, right? So we are still missing out 
heal the fires, for example, and call the horde, and also even the Balrog himself. So, in total, we are missing out about 36 power points. Because we were pretty much the second we were able to attack Minas Tirith, we did. So, you could get also a couple of heroes to level 10 if you wanted to. But I just wanted to finish the evil campaign um, and start a good campaign already. So, starting tomorrow, we're gonna begin the good campaign. The first thing is gonna be, of course, uh, uh, the Mines of Moria. So stay tuned for this one. If you don't want to miss out the content in the future, guys, please make sure to subscribe to the channel and leave a like on this video as well. Likes are helping quite a lot, and I would really appreciate that. Oh! He killed somebody right now. And you know what's the sad part? I couldn't even see where Gandalf got killed. That's the sad part. I just wanted to see how Gandalf dies, but it's not possible anymore. It's too late for this one. Maybe you guys can let me know in the comment section down below because I missed the timing on Gandalf's uh, goodbye to Middle Earth. You fool. Let's use Warchan, even though it doesn't war controls, but it looks good. Okay. Uma kill. Get inside the jeans there. Oh, this troll is actually still alive. Alright, I see you. Talking about I see you. I wanna, I wanna try out something. Yeah, it's working. You can even attack over the... Look, they are working like a siege monster at this point, right? It's so amazing. Did we do it? Yes, we did it. The enemy has been crushed. Enemy has been crushed. Victorious, ladies and gentlemen. Minas Tirith has fallen. I mean, the Balrog wasn't there, but it's fine. We got, uh, we were playing with Sauron, even though he died. But it's also fine. GG's well played. I hope you guys enjoyed the entire series of the evil uh, faction campaign for the Shadow and Flame mod. My personal impression is amazing. If you haven't tried it yet, make sure to try it out. It's really easy to download and install. All you need to do is to go to Google and type Shadow and Flame mod for BFME1. Download, run it and GG. And I am gonna start tomorrow immediately, the second I'm coming home from work to uh, play the good campaign. And if you don't want to miss it out, please make sure to be subscribed to the channel. I will see you next time. Until then, take care of yourselves. And as always, stay beyond standards. Peace.